your life like this is what your life like try to live Hi guys, what is up? My name is Elizabeth Ashley. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, make sure you like and subscribe this video for more. Um, today's video is gonna be a little bit different. It's going to actually contain my bridesmaids proposal boxes. Um, I had so much fun putting these together and I hope my bridesmaids liked them as much as I did. Um, but without further ado, let's get into the video. Actually, with further ado, Shout out to my fiance for shooting all of the B-roll and putting it all together. Love you, boo. Okay, for real this time. Okay, so I actually got the idea to do a bridesmaid proposal box from another YouTuber. Um, and I thought it was just a cute way of asking and I thought it would be really personal and super fun to do. So these boxes are actually cake boxes and I ordered almost everything on Amazon and I will be sure to link it all. Um, I think I actually did get a few things from Walmart including this satin fabric as well as the crinkle stuffing and the tooling. I think the only thing that I didn't get from Amazon may have been the alcohol. So I just kind of went in with the crinkle stuffing and the tool and the satin um, and kind of layered the satin one on top. Um, to give it a little bit of a boost. I felt like it looked a little bit more wedding-y and more luxurious than just the stuffing. And then I got these like 14 karat Swarovski crystal necklaces off Amazon. I thought they were so cute and they would match any of the girls and their personalities. Um, they're super plain, so I thought they might get a lot of use out of them. So I love that touch. And I just stuffed those up into the right hand corner. And then I got a couple things of alcohol for each of the girls. I think I put a thing of this type of Prosecco and then the Belvedere vodka, which if you know me, I love Belvedere vodka, so I had to add it. And the entire time I was just kind of situating the fabric and everything around the box, so um, there wouldn't be too much movement. Um, and then I got these little jelly candies, which I absolutely love, and these little acrylic um, candy boxes. Um, I ordered all of this on Amazon. Um, they are, they turned out so cute. I was actually going for kind of like the Dylan's candy look, um, but I didn't want to buy each one for $20 in the city, so I kind of just did my own. Last thing I did add in there were these can't tie the knot without you hair ties. Thought they were a cute little tacky but cute touch. Um, and then I finished it off with just a little bow. And then I went in with these um, sticky pearls and I put them on the edge of the ribbons. I thought it gave it just a little bit of a feminine touch. And there you have it. I hope you guys enjoy the video. Make sure you like and subscribe for more wedding stuff. And let me know if you want more wedding stuff because I definitely have a lot. <laughs> 